Hi, my name is Carl Fechner from Internet Secrets Made Easy and today I want to talk about is anybody really looking online for your products and services. Um, most business owners don't realize just how big this is so I just want to go through some figures and just show you really you know just what this is what this is like. There's literally thousands of Australians are searching for your type of product or service every day and the average on online shopper spends up to seven hours researching online for a significant purchase. These uh, figures that I've got that I've got are from um, this this company redzy.com and you can see it's basically I've aimed it at for two opera tour operators, but it'll give you an idea just how big this is. And this is the online booking behavior that 97% 97 of people prefer to find businesses online and you can see in the brackets I've put the companies where these figures are so I'm not just making them up as I go. 20% of Google searches are for local information so if you have a local business please don't underestimate the power of having Google My Business and just go into Google and type in Google My Business and you'll be able to find that it's already there for you to claim your business and it's free. Over 50% of today's travelers will go online rather than phone to make travel bookings. And internet travel booking revenue has grown by more than 73% over the past five years. Tour operating websites, only 20% of tourism providers in Australia have no website at all and that's just amazing when you think about it. Only 50% of tourism providers in Australia currently have booking facilities on their websites. Nearly 32% of leisure travellers will request more information through your website before booking a tour. So don't underestimate the power of having a website. The facts speak for themselves here. Mobile phones now are the number one item to, uh, for people to take on, to take on holidays. 38% of leisure travellers and 50% of business travellers use mobile for travel information. 94% of TripAdvisor customers are using mobile to research local things to do. TripAdvisor is one of the real sleeping giants in the tourist industry or hospitality industry. You need to make sure that your business is on there. 33% of the time travelers go online during their trips finding local activities using their mobile dev devices. And here, this is Tourism Resorts Australia. So I have you presenting local activities to do um, online. Reviews. 79% of consumers trust online reviews as much as personal recommendations. 93% of global travelers say their booking decisions are impacted by online reviews. 95% of respondents read reviews before booking. Leisure travelers read six to seven reviews before booking. How many reviews do you have on your website or in your online presence? And 81% of all reviews are positive. So don't go to the place of thinking that bad reviews, if I have it up there where they can leave reviews, all I'm going to get is bad reviews. That is not true. In social media, 52% uh, of travellers use social media to plan a trip. 52% of travellers were so influenced by social media, they changed their original travel plans. What sort of social media presence do you have? 87% of those younger than 34 are using Facebook to solicit advice before making bookings. TripAdvisor has a global monthly visitor inflow of 57 million people as well as a member base that exceeds 36 million and this is growing all the time. More than 51% of travel brands that had a Facebook presence had an increase in business. Now this in here just is how big Facebook is in Australia in 2015. So when it's only going one way, it's growing. 
There's 13 million Aussies active each month on Facebook. 10 million Aussies active every day. 9 million on a mobile. 5 million watch a video every day. 65% of that's on a mobile screen. Uh, people check Facebook, these same users, so those 10 million users, check Facebook about 14 times per day. And, and there it is, first thing in the morning and last thing at night. So 10 million Aussies are active and looking at their Facebook in the morning and last thing at night. Please don't underestimate this or poo-hoo this. This is the new way of the way people communicate. And you must make sure that you get it into your headspace that this massive opportunity is here for you to take, for the smart business owner to take he can take, you know, that he or she can use this. And it's 1.7 hours of time every day. So just think about those 10 million. Uh, Aussies, every day, 1.7 hours average time is spent. And 35% share a new business or a product discovered. So if your business is not there and you haven't got an active presence, how the dickens can those 35% of the 10 million you know, uh, promote or share your business or product. Video. 62% of leisure travelers and 74% of business travelers want to see a video before they make a final decision. So you need, uh, you, there's no excuses these days with smartphones, good quality smartphones. It's so easy to create videos and post them up onto a YouTube account or post them up onto your website or Facebook or whatever. 45% of leisure travelers book instantly after watching a video of the travel activity. 62% of travelers want to watch videos of tours, sightseeing and cruises as well as hotel rooms and properties, airlines, etc. In fact, if we're working with a client that's a motel, we always make sure that there's a video presentation of every unique room that goes not only with just the still photos, but is on there for every unique room that's there. Now, this is for a little town or Marimbula, a coastal region town, but and this would apply to many coastal regions or many tourism uh, regions, but I just want to give you an idea just how big the traffic can be for some of these places. If we look at uh, Marimbula, the keyword, Australia-wide, it's average of 14,800 times. So you can see the figures here in the peak periods, it's 22,000, but even in the lowest times of the year in the off-peak season, there's still 9,900 times every month. Marimbula is typed in. Marimbula accommodation, even in the depths of winter in low peak, is still 2,400 people a month looking for accommodation in Marimbula. Marimbula caravan parks there, even in the winter, is still 480 is the lowest, uh, the lowest, and it's an average of 720 caravan parks, Marimbula caravan parks. If you've got a caravan park in Marimbula, do you come up with these search terms? Marimbula Caravan Park, just the difference with the singular to the plural, you can see the difference of the figures of what, of, you know, the difference in the figures here. Magic Mountain Marimbula, a tourist, um, you know, site that you can go to, or a tourism place, activities, there it is, you can see 1,900 average searches per month. Marimbula weather, is 8,100 times with a peak in the summer at 14,800. So it just shows you how often you know people are using and searching for these. Marimbula real estate. Marimbula real estate is absolutely booming at the moment and you can see the figures of what's taking place in just with that term. And the Marimbula news which is quite I understand is quite a good smart online presence. You can see there it's averaging 1,900 times per month. And things to do in Marimbula. There it is, what people are typing in. Things to do in Marimbula. Average of 480 times and this uh, per month. And this will apply in your region, in your area. You know, similar figures. Don't dis discard this and think it's just unique to Marimbula. This happens everywhere. I see it time and time again. Now, what happens when you get this right? This is what I'll show you. 
we had an 800% in sales. Uh, it was a Greg Messer fixed price granny flats. 100% increase in online bookings from our website and East Gippsland Motel. The secrets, the secrets that Carl has taught me has really enhanced our business and profitability. He's been one of our clients for a long time and just kicking goals. In 18 months, we had a 200% increase in sales from Mountain Harvest Foods at, at Jimbrook on top of Google and getting calls from all over Australia, Mountain Harvest Foods. Your next step, you can do nothing and that co that's like long-term commercial suicide. You can attempt to do it by yourself and it's a steep learning curve and media, uh, media outcome at best. I can partner with you to help you develop a digital marketing strategy uniquely tailored for your business. And, and develop a training and implement, implementation program so you can develop lifelong skills to be able to manage and operate you know, your online presence. And it's rolled out over a six month period until you become for, uh, proficient. And you can register your expression of interest now with me. You can call me on my mobile on 0409 587733 or you can email me at Profit at internetsecretsmadeeasy.com and if there's lots of free resources there at at uh, our website so go there have a look or if you want to take it to another step give me a call and we can talk about it hey thanks for your time